I'm here about to eat the hamburger in the hamburger operation, La Frida Burgers, that is run by the OTG guys and Mike Corey here in the airport. Given the fact that this was a Burger King before, biggest upgrade in hamburger history. I mean, I, I very much want to like these hamburgers. Obviously, these guys were so nice to me. They, they let me in here in the airport, cleared it with Homeland Security or whatever. And, you know, I wouldn't, you know, Frida's obviously, I'm very close with them. I don't want to disappoint them. But on the other hand, it's very hard to make burgers well in this kind of environment. Oh, all right, here we are. Jesus, God, look at this. So I got the regular Americano. and This is the, what they call the fat cat. This has got an egg bacon and Taylor pork roll on it. And then this is the triple. This is the gordita, 15.5 ounces of Lafreda beef, an obscene amount by any standard. All right, let's see what it tastes like. Well salted, well seasoned, passes the squeeze test, nice sear. Now we'll do number two. This is truly obscene. I wish I had thought of it myself. There's two, I've never eaten anything like this in my life. I mean, I won't, you're not gonna believe me if I say that. All I can say is, if you eat this before your flight, you are not gonna need clonopin. The truth is though, you don't taste the burgers as good with this. It's delicious, but it, all this stuff overwhelms the meat. Josh Ozersky versus the gordita. Mike, though, this little, this amount of onion for this is not, this is hardly sufficient. This is like if you see, this is like when you see the sumo wrestler that wears the little diaper, you know? I shouldn't like this. I should be against this. It, it breaks all the rules of art structure and symmetry that I supposedly believe in. That is so intense. That is such a concentrated beef bomb. And there's also all this pepper and salt, so there's like a nice hot finish. This is a great, great modern age we're living in, and every day it gets better.